Hi there, it's Wade McMaster here. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can set up pretty much uh, like a, a template or basically a template for your videos when you're uploading. So that way you have everything locked and loaded and ready to go when you go to upload new videos. So the way it works is quite simple. You log into YouTube, you head up to the top right here and you're gonna go into your YouTube studio. Now you'll notice I have a few extra settings due to uh, vidIQ, but um, yeah, all these settings are available. The ones I'm about to use are actually available to you just in YouTube. So I'm going to go into settings here. And this is a person, this is just my personal channel. So you'll notice a few things blurred out and a few funny stats. Uh, the, the main channel this is actually viewing this from is completely different. But you see a section here called upload defaults. Now you can even add, you can add in some defaults here in your title. So if you're following anything in particular and you want some keywords you want to mention in all of them, so maybe you're talking about dog walking, you can even just add dog walking in there in brackets or maybe it's, uh, if you're a YouTube tips, tips channel, YouTube tips, uh, I'm gathering if you're watching this video, you're probably not from a YouTube tips channel, but that's all right. Uh, you can add in anything in your title there and then when you create a new video, it'll all be there ready and waiting for you. So. Um, I'm just going to leave this as blank for now, and maybe I'll just put um, 2020 in there, just something just for the sake of the video. Description, obviously you want to have some, what I like to do is even have like intro, main keywords, so a little bit of a prompt, links, and maybe I'll have follow me on social media, find me on Facebook, so I'll go, you know, type in my actual HTTPS address. And yeah, find me on Twitter. And I'll use, I'll use the creator impact handle. So this means that every time I create a new video, even if you have a, this is great if you have a call to action and you want to send people to an email sign up, you can pop that with a link in there. Anything you want to show up on every video you create from here on out can be added here. And if you have existing videos, you can actually edit them in bulk, which is another video I've actually uh, just recently done. So uh, check out a link to that in the description below. But um, this is basically set up your title, your description, visibility if you want them all to start off as unlisted. I generally do that and then release them when I'm ready. And of course, if you have common tags in there, so maybe you know if you're a 3D animation channel, you might say 3D animation is a tag I always have. Um, maybe you put your name there as a tag for whatever reason and you can set this up I'm gonna click Save and then we're basically good to go but you can actually go through and do more so I'm just gonna go back in upload defaults and under advanced settings here not gonna look into these too heavily but obviously you can change your YouTube license if you're looking at creating Creative Commons material so stuff you don't want to hold any copyright over um, you can do that you can set up a category so maybe it's under entertainment Comments, you can set up your comments. So hold all comments for review, disable comments. So if you want to disable comments on all videos, you can do that or you want to change those settings. You can go through and set this up on all of them. So all of my videos are going to be in English and save that. So they're just default settings for your video, but it's really handy because it allows you to really personalize like your social media and all those bits and pieces there. So that way, you kind of streamline your process a little bit when you're creating videos in the future. So I'm actually going to save that now. And I'm going to upload a video. I'm not going to release it, but I'm going to basically upload a quick video. I'm going to drag it across from here. And straight away, you can see here, we've got 2020, intro of the main keywords. So I can type in what I want here. So here's my intro copy my keywords and all this information is already there so we're basically in a situation where everything is set and ready to go so we don't have to worry about adding in these bits down the bottom and like I said in another video if you want to change this in the future you can use your bulk editor to remove uh, any strings of information and then you can simply go in and add it back in at the end of the description in one hit so that's something worth looking into once again I, I'll put a link to that in the description below but um, yeah, just a quick way to set up a little video template for your videos so you can streamline that process. All right, I uh, hope you liked that video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you want more like this, please consider uh, you know, subscribing to my channel. Otherwise, uh, yeah, I hope to speak to you again soon. Thanks for watching the video and I'll see you later.